Okay, go. Hey guys, I'm Braxton. We are driving and we're going to go pick up an estate called the Duns. We got a phone call uh, about a week ago. We came out and evaluated the estate and uh, now we're going to go pick it out. We're picking it up in two different uh, scenarios. We're going to pick up uh, about 20 items today for a quality auction we got coming up and then the other stuff is going to be going to our Memorial Day which we'll be picking up next week. But you're going to get a tour, a little bit of everything and uh, we're going to introduce, introduce you to the Duns. So, hope you enjoy. God bless. We'll see you at the Dunn's house in, uh, I think it's Lawrenceville, Georgia. All right, we're here at the Dunn's house and we're fixing to get the box to load and go in and check it out. So uh, come on, I'll introduce you to her and uh, give you a tour around. So check it out. Go. Hey guys, we're inside. This is actually Miss Dunn and uh, this is her estate. And uh, are you ready for this? I think so. <laughs> you <laughs> you so. think so. And, you're, so? and you're moving when? On uh, third Wednesday. And you're moving Wednesday. So she's moving to a retirement village. So she calls us and said, come pick up a lot of it. So the families pull out a few things they want, but more than likely, we're gonna haul it all back and sell it at auction for her. So we're gonna give you a little tour of what it does. We're gonna help Miss Dunn get all taken care of. <laughs> so they, they just showed me this, uh, Anvil, an original. It was a salesman sample. A salesman yeah, sample. Mid, um, 1930s. 1930, yeah. original yeah. Anvil brand salesman sample, still with the original label on it. House is full of this stuff, so anyway. I'll give you a little tour, so we'll check it out. check this out this is she it was actually a collector of thimbles this is actually a a spool cabinet it's full size but every drawer is full of thimbles so we're trying to evaluate how in the world we're gonna we're gonna sell thimbles but every drawer is full um, not only that they're on the walls on the little displays now, over here is another spool chest, another spool cabinet that's full. But it's, uh, it's everywhere, so we're going to keep going and we're going to load you up and keep showing you some more pictures. Ooh, this is cool. This is actually a Van Briggle right. turtle. Where did you get this at? I got that in... Uh... This at the van. No, right now, is this where you? Oh, this is the uh, Colorado Springs. So you live in Denver. Well, you got how long have you had? Um, gosh, when did you live in Denver? About that was what? seventy-eight or seven. You left. That's a unique piece. Unique piece. Yeah. It's a unique, very unique. Yeah. So very good. All right. <laughs> Maybe it'll go for a thousand dollars. Oh, would that be it. exciting? <laughs> Probably go for about 75, 60, 70, 80 bucks. Is that right? Yeah. We shall see. He was my prize. He, he was He's your prize turtle? I don't think it was the only Ben Brickle. These are some really neat items that I found, so we're going to let Ms. Dunn tell us what these are. 
This is actually, I think, a Victorian sewing bird and a. And this is a little natural sewing machine. Where did and you get I, this at? Um, I got it in Pittsburgh when I lived there. When I was collecting thimbles, I'd find all kind of little things like this in drawers in um, uh, the treadle sewing mm -hmm. machines and places like that. So. Now, is that a usable? Can somebody actually sew with that? Uh, we. Got it so it would, so it would go up and down. Now, that's been about 20 years ago, so I'm not sure. And what, what is and this? This tube, they uh, put it on their sewing machine, clamped it, and this hurt, hold, held the material when they were sewing to keep it up from dragging on the ground. So this would clip on the sewing machine. I guess you put and your then old sewing, little yeah. pin cushion up on top. Of them. Well, excellent. So, Beautiful. Then, Very unique items. Right. We'll see what they sell for. Well, it'll be interesting. It'll be, it'll be interesting. Hey guys, we're, uh, we're done loading up with first load for Miss Dunn. I hope you enjoyed it. She's a very sweet lady. and going to be moving to a, a retirement village here within the next few weeks. So we got our first load, and uh, we're going to show back up here in about, uh, I think we have about two and a half, three weeks before we come back, and we're going to strip the house of uh, anything that she's not going to take to her new house. So anyway, I hope you enjoy it, and uh, we'll see you at the auction. A lot of the stuff you'll be able to buy at the auction, so check out auction78.com. Hey guys, we're back from the pickup of Miss Dunn's, and uh, this is a few things that we picked up uh, going through our May 6 auction. Uh, large uh, Wedgwood cheese dish, southern uh, salt glaze, nice little lamp, some Mary Gregory, some killer little stuff, unique stuff. So uh, this is the end of it for lot one. We're going to try to uh, videotape and record some of uh, what they're going to sell for at the auction and add it to this video. So check back later and uh, keep watching. See you later.